Yeah, I know it's almost over, but I want to give a little bit more feedback before it ends. Um, first of all, she's pretty cute, but... Um, Okay, Nightwish fans, I am back with another first time reaction video to another song from them. Wow, I must have hit some uh, some nerves in my last video, apparently, um, for comparing them to, well, comparing, I guess, Floor is her name, to the girl from Evanescence, so <laughs> I apologize for that. Um, I haven't even listened to that much Evanescence, to be honest. Uh, just the, the one song, I can't even remember the name of it, but the, the one popular song that they had. Um, so, you know, be take it easy on me a little bit. I just, I, I haven't heard enough of her. It's just, it, for whatever reason, it reminded me um, of her. And obviously, it must have reminded other people as well for you guys to have reacted that way when you keep hearing people uh, comparing her to uh, Evanescence. Um, Amy Lee, I think is her name, but um, yeah, and, and it's I'm not taking anything away. Um, and, and really, I really should have. I just realized because I'm going to be watching Romanticide um, from I think the same performance. It's their official live video. I probably should have watched one of their earlier stuff, uh, one of their earlier videos first because I could see the uh, the other singer. Because it seems like from a lot of the feedback, everyone is saying that this singer is is much better um, than the first. So I, you know, I'll probably check out one of the earlier videos with the original singer later and compare them. But she definitely has a great voice, and and I really really like the last song. So I'm looking forward to hearing something else from them. Um, no idea what this one is like. I can't remember because it's been actually a little while since I've done this reaction on the feedback about this particular song and what kind of sound it is but i think from when i was reading uh, you know some of the comments they they're kind of all over the place with their sound i mean they don't necessarily um all sound like trans-siberian orchestra which i guess could also have hit a nerve with some people but that's what the last one kind of reminded me of um yeah so without further ado let's give this one a shot i'll give you my feedback as i watch I appreciate everybody watching today. If you can hit the like button, I would appreciate that. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, uh, please do. And let's watch, for the first time, Nightwish Romanticide.
yeah, that's a completely different sound than the last one. Um, what was the name of that one? I'm sorry for not remembering. It was Ghost, Ghost Love Score or Ghost Score or something like that. Sorry about that. But um, yeah, I mean, right off the bat, much heavier, uh, really cool guitar riffs. And uh, the drumming was really, really cool, really good drumming. And I think somebody mentioned that, because um, I, I think I made a comment in my last video about the crowd surfing. I thought that was a little odd for that particular song, but they said that watch this one, it'll make more sense. And, and I can see what you mean. Um, it's definitely a heavier song and her voice really, really, really nice. I'm going to try not to compare. And it doesn't sound like the girl from Evanescence in this one at all. Um, maybe, maybe heart a little bit. <laughs> I don't I shouldn't even try to compare because I'm going to get a lot of people, uh, saying some, saying some stuff, but, um, yeah, it's funny because the the guitaring sounds heavy, and she's singing heavy for sure, like you know a heavier sound. But her voice kind of like um, I don't know how to describe it. You know, it doesn't it doesn't sound as heavy as the instrument sound, but still sounds very nice. It still sounds very well. You know, fits it well. But uh, it's just a different sound. This is completely new music to me, new musical style, really. Um, but I like it. Let's uh, let's keep it going. I'll go back a little bit. solo it's a good night for a beverage I know it's almost over, but I want to give a little bit more feedback before it ends. Um, first of all, she's pretty cute. but uh, And she looks like she's really tall. I can't really quite tell from the stage, but I'm guessing that she's pretty tall. I think that, you know, one of the things that's just different about this band what, compared to what I'm used to is it's kind of, I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of like theatrical or something, like the way that they perform, which makes me 
you know, as I'm watching them, think of they how I mean, obviously they're live here, but actually seeing them live, how cool it would be, you know, to be at at a performance like this. Um, the drumming, and even the drumming with the guitaring together, especially at that part where you know the drumming started started kicking in, it reminded me a little bit of Metallica, which I love Metallica. I'm a huge Metallica fan. Um, but yeah, I mean. It's different, and I like how they they mix it up. You know, like the song. It's not just this, you know, straightforward song. You know, with uh, verse, chorus, verse, and so forth. Like they they, at least in these two songs, there's like kind of like a a stopping point and a change in how the song is going, and I'm really enjoying that. Um, I know we're getting near the end, so I'm gonna get back into it. But I just want to give you a little bit of feedback as I'm watching. Let's uh, let's go back a little bit and watch the end. Yeah, very nice. I would say, you know, that is probably more my style than the first one. Again, because it's a little bit harder. Um, and not that I'm into like really, really heavy stuff, but like I said, I like Metallica. Uh, but I really, I actually really, really enjoyed that one. I will say that, again, I mean, I think being there was probably really incredible, being at that concert. Um, they definitely seem to be a band that is made to be live, to watch them perform live. Um, I, I was just thinking about the other thing that I said that hit a lot of nerve nerves, I should say, in my uh, last reaction is the Eurovision comment. And again, that's just my ignorance. I've only ever seen like bits and parts of that, you know, from that Will Ferrell movie and um, I wouldn't, I would definitely, after watching this, think there's no way that they would be in, in a Eurovision. But, um, although I think somebody out there did say that they could see it. So maybe I'm not the only one, but, uh, yeah, she is really talented. And when she hits those high notes, at least in this song, it was kind of reminding me a little bit of like late seventies, early eighties, heavy metal, like Iron Maiden-ish. Um, again, you know, maybe thinking of um, heart a little bit. Really, really, really strong, nice voice that she has. Um, and musically, obviously the whole band is very talented. The drumming and guitars together was great. Really love that. So, yeah, I think, uh, I guess that's it for this one. But I know that there's a lot of stuff they have out there. So I think that uh, I would like to watch one of their earlier videos with the original singer so if you guys can recommend uh one that you think that i should watch i would appreciate it i'll take a look at it and um as always any other recommendations are appreciated and if you haven't already liked this video if you could like it if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please do and uh i will see you guys on the next one thanks for watching